Welcome back to the Mercedes-Benz Stadium. Right before the break, there was a timeout. The place is very loud, too. upset, but you would think they told Klubnik what he needed to know, what they wanted him to do in that situation. Yeah, I think it took him a little while to decide, all right, hey, let's at least try it. I think they tried to get their hard count operation to get out there and see if he can't get George to dump off sides. It, used, it worked in success a little earlier when Michael Williams jumped into the neutral zone, so they tried it, but they just didn't give it enough of a sell. They didn't give it enough time at the line of scrimmage to really make Georgia think about it. Watson punts and takes a bad bounce for Clemson. Just 70 yards of total offense for the Tigers. And on the fourth punt of the day from Aiden Swanson, perhaps leg weary. 34 yard punt. Well, we mentioned it earlier. This is the 40th anniversary of one of the great games in the history of this rivalry. Mix 
Watkins the tackle. We asked Kirby Smart yesterday what would be the extent of Wintering's range. He said the 35-yard line. This is the 37, but they are going to apparently try a long one. It would be a career long. The 55-yarder, his long last year was 48. He missed his only try last season from beyond 50. Beck is the holder. He's a new starter this year. Redshirt sophomore from Webster, Texas. After further discussion, there is no foul for defensive pass. pass. I like 
this no call actually because you see the left hand of Adam Randall actually trying to push off as well but that's a bad throw there by Cade Klubnik. Randall's got two three yards of separation you have to throw that ball to the outside anything under thrown is going to allow the defender to recover so you've got to get that ball up and down you've got to keep him vertical the big play was wiped out there Apple Sweeney complaining to the side judge Milton Britton who had absolutely nothing to do with it. Fourth down and three. And here comes the fifth punt. That's part of the job though of those officials on the sideline. They take an earful. There's a lot of things they have absolutely nothing to do with. I think that was the right call though. I mean, because it looked like you could have called OPI. I think you could have called DPI. So you might as well just make it a no call. Call a no PI. <laughs> Matt Austin, by the way, is what Palatial will say is nodding his head on the ring with you. Swanson again caught on the run by Anthony Evans. And he's taken down immediately. It's the snapper again, Philip Florenzo. Here's Molly. Sean, on that last Georgia possession, Carson Beck had an incompletion. Yeah, Molly was last. It's on the side of the foot of Floyd. He matched up. We'll be right back after these words. 